Hey y'all, hey, how you doing? What up though? Listen, I tried to record this video two times yesterday and it did not record for me. I was all driving and talking to y'all and then I don't know what happened. I guess I ain't saved it quick enough. It disappeared or something. I don't know. But um, I'm going to do this real quick. So I was actually getting me some cookies. Insomnia cookie, right? I don't know if people have shared that crumble cookie. I tried that place. I didn't like it. It wasn't good to me. The cookies felt doughy. They weren't done. They, I just, It wasn't for me. But this insomnia cookie right here is so good. So I got three of them. A chocolate chip, a peanut butter, and an M&M. And I'm going to share them with my daughter, I guess. But anyway, I want to record this video really quick. Because I uploaded a, a Kingdom Spouse update the other day. And it got a lot of views, which I was really surprised. Which I don't know why it surprised me. But majority of my videos don't get that many views. Don't be waiting on this spot. Because I'm about to sit here for a minute and talk to y'all. So if you're waiting on this spot, you're you going to be messed up. Because I'm not about to pull out right now. Um, But I guess I could drive and talk to y'all. Let me drive and talk to y'all so they can have this spot. Don't be like that, Toya. Hold on, y'all. So, I was just saying this. So, I uh, shared an update with you all. And... Um, the light turned red anyway. Hold on. I should update with you all how things have gone. So the thing I wanted to talk about was um, not getting weary and well doing. So um, we have been going to the gym, right? We've been going to the gym together for the last week or so. And last week um, we went to the gym, I think every day except Thursday. Well, Monday through Friday except Thursday because I had an early work day. So we didn't go Thursday, but we went the other days. And so we've been going to the LA Fitness that I that I prefer to go to. Um, we went to some other gyms, but that's the one we've really been going to more so often than not. And, um, child, this little man got his car parked all in the street. He ain't even got no side view mirror, so you know he can't drive. Um, and so I was just thinking about this because there was a guy at the gym that always spoke to me, right? He was always very nice. He always spoke to me whenever he seen me. He was speaking. We would, you know, say, hey, how you doing? That kind of thing. He even asked me my name. We exchanged names, but I didn't really remember his name. Like, if I don't commit your name to memory, I'm not going to remember it. So we were at the gym on Friday, and I could see him. I could see my honey talking to the guy, right? And I just figured they just having a conversation because that's what he do he talked to people right and um so when i finished doing what i was doing i was going to let him know i was going to go into the sauna before we left and so when i got over there to him and the guy he introduced me to the guy like this is my man such and such we grew up together you know i ain't seen him in a while and we just been catching up and da da da. and i'm just thinking like and i spoke to the guys i always do um but i was just thinking like had i what if I got weary and well doing, right? What if I said, okay, Lord, this is taking too long. I'm not even sure if this is what God has for me. Maybe I didn't hear God correctly. I'm about to go out here and just, you know, date a little bit until, you know, you know, they say you got to put yourself out here. So I'm going to go out here and date a little bit, see what's what, you know, I might be missing, I might be missing my husband, you know, while I'm sitting here waiting um, or whatever. So what if I had done that? And say, for instance, this young man uh, tried to talk to me and nod and talk to this young man and we didn't went out on some dates, even if it didn't go anywhere, but we didn't went out on some dates or whatever the case may be. And lo and behold, this is my honey's friend. Y'all, I would have been standing there looking crazy, okay? Could you imagine? Because I've had men try to talk to me in the gym all the time and not like every day, but you know, it's happened a handful of times for sure. And though he always spoke to me, um he's never tried to talk to me but I just thought to myself like what what if I had you know some one of the ones that had tried to talk to me because just because he knows this one doesn't mean he doesn't know the other people because he knows somebody everywhere we go um so I just say that to say I share my journey with you all and I do that from time to time because it's and encourage you to trust God for whatever it is that he's promised you even when it doesn't look like it right we all get discouraged. I got discouraged in the journey because it was times when we, we didn't even talk to each other. This braces, side note, I got my braces tightened the other day and this, this wire was sticking a mess out of me and it tore my jaw up. So yesterday I had to go back and had them fix it. So my mouth's still a little sore. So anyway, it's bothering me. Um, but I was saying, what, what happens if, I lost my train of thought. But if we get just weary and well-doing, right, and we, we, we get discouraged because we don't think that maybe we heard God wrong because there were times when I'm like, I must have heard God wrong. God ain't said nothing like this to me because this don't even look like what I thought God told me. Like, you didn't tell me this man, my husband, won't even talk. Like, even in our interactions together, he never talks to me about future stuff, about, you know, like, 
I had to be hearing God wrong. So even in that, now I'm out here trying to do my own thing and put something together with somebody that is not who God had created, ordained, or, you know, um, purpose for me to be with. So I share my journey to with you all to keep you encouraged along the way to show you how God is moving and how God is speaking. And even though this has been a seven year thing, um, it is a it's it's a beautiful and I am just I just sit in it sometimes really just thinking in amazement about like wow I'm really sitting in this thing that I prayed for for so long right like I, I remember praying for this and and it seemed like seven years is a long time which it is a long time we I'm not gonna say seven years is not a long time but looking back on the fact um I'm grateful for this journey. I'm grateful to God for the opportunity. I'm grateful to God for choosing me to love his son in the way he's requiring calling for me to love him. I'm grateful for all of that. And the other thing is, um, what else was I going to say? Dang, I forgot just that quick, but don't get weary and well doing. See, look, I can't even talk. Don't get weary and well doing. Dude, why are you walking down the middle of the street? People just especially older people like he ain't an old man but he is an older man older, older man probably his 50s they just think they can do what they want to do um it must be it is a red wings game i see people with their red wings gear on um but yeah y'all don't get weary and well doing stand on the promises of god even when it doesn't look like it and when you need that confirmation give him a con let ask god to give you that confirmation if and when you need it i was <laughs> scrolling through things uh uh, where was I scrolling through Instagram today and this little video popped up and I just happened to watch it and I didn't know what the video was and what it turned out to be it had that little song in the back like Desperado something 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 in a, I, I don't know what the song say but it had a little, this little boy right and he was pulling his shirt over his head and when he pulled his shirt over his head it was white and like his pants were black and he did like this and then up behind him popped four penguins I told y'all about my penguin thing the other day with them animal crackers. Four penguins standing behind the little boy because um, he didn't pull his shirt over his head. So now he looking like a penguin. And I had to record that like a... Um, can I, I might be able to upload it. I might maybe make it a short or something. I don't know. I'm going to try to do that so y'all can see what I'm talking about. But I had to... I just was like, okay, Lord, you funny. But if you need that confirmation, that encouragement seek God for it and ask him just to be sure like Lord I want to make sure this is what you're calling me to do I want to make sure I'm not standing for somebody that you never intended me to stand for have those confirmations because a lot of that I didn't know in the journey I didn't know any of that through this process thank you father so I'm glad that I get to share this with you all because I didn't know any like I told you I don't know nothing about no standing I didn't even know that was a thing like I just was like what if this meant to be God gonna bring it together when he meant to bring it together like but all this standing and doing all this I ain't know nothing about none of that I ain't never even heard of that stuff um that was all new for me so when they talking about the lord told me to stand i couldn't tell you the lord told me to stand because i ain't, i ain't know what that meant i ain't never heard nothing about no standing um so i think that's it now i'm just rambling on um i think that's it y'all but again don't get weary and well doing seek god for confirmation if that's what you need to stay encouraged and stay in his plan and his will do not go outside of the will of god and attach yourself to some foolishness and some nonsense creating all kind of soul ties with people that god never intended for you to be with and now you got to deal with all kind of foolishness we're gonna bust this turn because these people are trying to park for they they red wings game um that's it y'all that's it. I pray y'all have a blessed evening. I'm about to eat these cookies. Um, I'm going to eat a half of every one. I'm going to eat half of one and she can have the other half. I don't know. She might not even like peanut butter. I don't know, but I'm going to eat half of one each one of these because I want one of each one of these. And I will talk to y'all later. God, listen, be encouraged. Be encouraged. Be encouraged. Ain't that what that, um... What's that man named Donald Lawrence song say, I think? Be encouraged. Sometimes you got to encourage yourself. Be encouraged. I will talk to y'all later. I love you. God loves you. And Jesus loves you. So, let me, let me stop staring at people. Bye, y'all. Bye.